from the Middleby Marshall PS570 oven. This is the, uh, the bushing, the bushing retainer and the shaft adapter that goes in the shaft. Now you'll notice this piece fits here, the retainer stops it here. And uh, what, in, what eventually ends up happening, that's this demonstration of all these other shafts, is these bushings spin inside this adapter, cuts, in, cuts, cuts the bushing in half, there you go, wads the bushings, and then it eventually starts cutting the shaft adapter in half, and I've got wads of those cut in half. And uh, it just, and then it cuts off a quarter inch of the shaft, as you can see here. So even if you know, I go ahead and replace it, and I put in a brand new shaft bushing retainer, and sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. And six months later, it's cut the thing in half again. All of these are you know, cut in halves. It's poor design, if you ask me. So I came up with my own design. This is a uh, this bushing is like I don't know half an inch. My bushing is nylon or plastic, and it's like three quarters of an inch thick. It takes up the exact amount of space. But the difference is when you put in the shaft adapter, my the, the shaft adapter now is also part of the bearing surface. I don't know how I could demonstrate that to you, except that it comes out to here instead of stopping at the end of the shaft here. So it actually, see that, see that? The shaft and the adapter are now one bearing surface, which solves this problem. And I called Middleby and I asked him about it. What are we supposed to do to stop this thing from, from spinning and cutting itself in half? And, you know, they didn't have an answer. So I was either starting to try to dink it, but that didn't work. And then I took maybe a hammer and banged it, you know, just to pinch and hold this bushing still. But, no, I don't know. This is my solution. I've got it in a bunch of ovens, and it seems to be working perfectly. I have not gone back to replace a single after I've installed this. And it's for sale on eBay. Just look up, I don't know, what, what, what do you think we should call it? The new bushing? So to fix this miserable design that doesn't seem to last four weeks, we have this, we'll just call it nylon block. Fits perfectly, rolls nice and smooth. Problem solved. So if you're tired of replacing shafts with cut-off ends, shaft adapters that are cut off, shaft adapters cut in half, bushing retainers that are warbled out, bushings, go over to eBay and buy my new bushing that replaces all of that and solves the problem.